Uh, so this is Aeneid, book 2, lines 2 th 212 through 224. Um, and this, in this section, Aeneas is describing Laocoon's death. Um, and just to remember, in the last few lines, he had just described how two uh, twin serpents had risen up out of the water to attack Laocoon. Okay. Defigmus vis sexanguis illagmine certo Laocoonta petunt et primum parva duorum corpora naturum surpens em plexus uterque, implicat et miseros morsu de pascator artus. Uh, so we scattered pale by the sight, um, that is, of the serpents, and they, uh, again referring to the serpents, they seek Laocoon with a certain battle line, and first, uh, the serpent, having embraced the two, uh, or I'm sorry, the small bodies of the two sons, uh, entwines both and devours their miserable limbs with fangs. Post ips auxilio subeuntac tela ferentem, curipiunt spirisque ligant ingentibus et iam, bis meriam plexi, bis colos quamea circum, terga dati superant capitet cervicibus altis. So after they seize him, um, and that's Laocoon, so they seize him, uh, bringing help and carrying weapons, um, and they bind him with huge coils. And now, uh, having embraced his middle twice, twice, uh, having placed their scaly backs around his neck, they overcome him uh, with a head and long necks. Ille simo manibus tendit de velre noros, perfusus sanie vitas atroque veneno, clamore simo horrendos ad sidra tolit, qualis mugitus fugit cum saucius aram, taurus et in certax gusit cervice securim. So at the same time, he, um, and that's Leaco on again. He stretches with his hands to tear apart the knots, having soaked his band with blood and with black poison. At the same time, he hurls horrible shouting to the stars. Such a kind, uh, or sorry, such a roar as when an injured bull flees the altar and shakes off the uncertain axe from his neck. Uh, and that is it for this little section of the Aeneid, um, which was book two, lines 212 through 224.